Hi, I'm Andrea and this is The Coin Couch. I think we're going to pick out this one and B. First up is the 2020 Australian Olympic team one kilo fine silver coin. Now I've put everything back in the box so we can actually take it from step one of the unboxing. And this thing, when I say huge, it's huge. Now before we move on, I just really wanted to point out the images on the top of the box here, because this carries through to the coin, but I think it's just so cool. Whoever came up with this concept of the beginning with origami, slowly folding your paper and then turning into the koi fish, which will eventually turn into something else on the coin itself, I think it's just a great concept. So whoever designed it, shout out to you. You might actually find out inside on this certificate. So there we go, we've got our RAM box there. It's a cardboard black box. Lovely little felt that protects this gorgeous, gorgeous wooden box here. And let me just show you, you've got the iconic angled RAM opening there. I'm gonna lift this out. Now, I know this is actually quite close to the camera, but I can't get my camera further away. This thing is that big. So there we go, you've got Australian Government, Royal Australian Mint there. And let's open this. Beautiful. Oh, it's breathtaking, it really, really is. Now, as I said, it does have the certificate there in the box. We will take a quick look at that. So there we go, this particular point is number nine. And, oh there we go, it's designed by Jody Clark. Good job Jody. <laughs> and here's all our stats here. So the denomination is 30 Australian dollars. We've got 99.9% .9 silver there. And, oh sorry, hold on a minute, no. My bad, Jodie Clark is the designer of the um, reverse, uh, of her side I mean, that particular portrait of Queen Elizabeth. So B King is the designer of this one. Sorry B King, we'll give Jodie Clark a shout out too, designing Her Majesty's portrait, but the biggest shout out does go to B King. I think this is a fantastic design. And here's the most interesting thing about this particular coin, the mintage. Only 50 pieces of these big ones. Very cool. Now speaking of big ones, so heavy. I'm not going to be able to get that out. Let's take this part out first. It really is a big one. So the ribbon stuck there. Try and take that out first, I think. I think the ribbon is actually meant to go there to help get this part out. So, look at that. So as I pointed out before on the front of the box, you have the origami there, starting with the plain piece of paper, folding, folding a little bit more, and then turning into the koi fish, which then turns into swimmers. Now, swimmer, swimming is actually one of the oldest Olympic sports started since the first Olympics were held. And the koi fish is actually a symbol of strength and courage. Which you 
definitely need if you are involved with the Olympics. Now I'm just gonna slip this guy out. Gosh, I say slip. This is really packed well in there. I mean, that's not sliding around within that box at all. Let's have a closer look here. There we go, Australian Olympic team. $30, as I said before, and one kilo. That is a serious, serious coin. Over here as well, you have the Australian emblem there for the Olympics. And underneath, I would assume, you've got the emblem for Japan. Now, over the other side, we mentioned Jodie Clark before, this is her design of Queen Elizabeth II. And of course, it says 2020 because it is the 2020 Olympics. Even though we are holding it this year. Oh, that is phenomenal. That weight. Get another closer look at this side. I mean, look at the detail in the water. It's just fantastic. I mean, the, the details around the koi fish themselves and then the actual competitors there swimming. Remarkable. Really a standout coin. It's really, really cool. And, oh, it's really, really heavy. I mean, I feel like I have to be in the Olympics just to hold it. Surely. Now, I'm just going to put this to the side for a second because there's something else I want to show you here in this box. Obviously, we've seen this part can be removed. But before, I was poking around and inside here, it's not anything illegal, don't worry. I hope not. I think I've worked out what it is. We unroll that. You've got two little metal rods. The other one's in there. I'll keep that in there actually. I won't open that up. But just to show you, here's the metal rod. And that then fits in to the back here. Slightly screw that in. There you go. And if you have. Obviously, you'd put the other one in there and have it to stand up. This isn't just your regular coin where you can use the little magnets at the front here and there. You really need some stand to display that coin proudly. Just amazing. So what do we all think about that coin? I mean, I know there'll be a lot of Olympic coins coming out, for sure. But I really, I mean, the koi fish had me. He had me at koi fish. Do that better in a minute. Let's take one last look at this beauty. First incredible. Now we're going from a big one to our two little ones, so let's get on to them. And here they are. So why don't we start with the next silver one? Here we go, it is Year of the Ox. Now, most of you should recognize the look of this one. This is struck by the Perth Mint in Australia. Of course, I'm very fond of the Perth Mint as well. I wonder why I'm partial to these Australian mints. It's a bit of a mystery, isn't it? <laughs> so, of course, this is silver. Now, this one, the mintage is not known yet. So, will they produce more? Will they not? What will the number get to? There's another mystery for you. Now this one is 25 cents. And it is one quarter ounce silver. We've got the colour ox on there. Trying to get focused. There he is. Very sweet this design. I mean really, they've done well. The ox is looking quite attractive really. Very cool. And this is, of course, if you've been following the Lunar series from the Perth Mint, this is the third time they're doing it. And you'll also know that they always do a range of them in different sizes. So next up, here's the gold. Also with that same design. A tiny little ox. Why 
What a cutie. Now this one does have a number on its mintage. This is 20,000 pieces. And you're getting one tenth ounce gold. This one is $15. I just really, I think these small coins are just a bit of fun as well because they're something different, aren't they? A lot of the time we always hear hold the one ounce, very common. And it is nice, especially for the gold. You know, if you can't afford the bigger gold coins, it's nice just to get a little, just a little bit. And they're so cute. <laughs> So these are our coins for today. We've got our two little ones there and then our oh, massive monster. So there we go, that's our video for today. If there were any coins on the table that you saw and you thought, hey, I wanna take a closer look at that and Andrea didn't show us that today, do tune in to EMK's YouTube channel and there'll be more unboxing and product videos coming on there. Also, if you're not, you should be, uh, subscribe to EMK's Facebook page, Instagram account, and TikTok. Now, from what I hear, there's a really cool person who makes those TikToks, so they're a lot of fun. I wonder who that could be. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you next time on the Coin Couch. Thanks always for watching. Ciao.